Howdy, folks. Um, I just got in the car. I'm in a rush to run errands, but look at this. Can't tell, but my seat is moving. <laughs> Easy pleasures, my friend. And for a short person, I need to be near the steering wheel. So that's a really fun remembrance when I got in the car this morning. And um, I'm not gonna go into a ton of details just because I'm not sure on it, but we might have just found our new car to buy. So fingers crossed, this is a car we actually haven't ever seen before, but um, a friend of ours knew about it two years ago when we initially started the thought process of buying a new car. And it is now on the market. So if I can get this bugger sold today or tomorrow or the next day, whatever, I hopefully will be able to buy myself a new car. And Jason is at work today. The kids are all home from school. It is a teacher work day and so they are all hanging out at home and none of them wanted to come with me. I've got a bunch of errands to run. I've got to go to the bank. My stupid bank um, eliminated their drive through So dumb. So now I have to go into the bank. <laughs> oh, there's Jason. Hang on one second. All right, you guys, so I'm stuck in traffic. My phone here is about to die any minute now. And stuck in traffic. But look how, I mean, it's blue skies. So such a pretty day today. So I kind of can't complain that you know, I can roll my window down and have it be a little bit loud because it's only 50 degrees and the sun is shining and I have some time in the car by myself and it's quiet and it's kind of nice to kind of just, I don't mind this traffic. I'm going to just relax here for a second. All right, <laughs> it's I'm one o'clock and I've been out all morning. I was feeling kind of guilty Tell about being gone, except the girls made cookies. Well, I, I, I right? Looks like Abby made cookies. With me. I sit back and relax and then wait till we're done. So. Yeah, I know, <laughs> Abby really made them. Okay, are you still gonna wear your jammies today? Okay, I want you to go find friends to play with. You have a day off school, go play. Yay. Okay, go find friends. You guys, I've been here in my office. This is why I make my office all cute and nice, and I have my cute little, um, my cozy cover for my jar. I have this, don't tell Ashley, I hide it, because I spend a lot of time right here. <laughs> Paid bills, got everything current, Got our make, to make sure our credit is good to buy a new car. We still haven't figured that out quite yet, but we're close. And the teenagers came over, so I had to be in close proximity to them because there's boys that come over, right? And we're going to read. Yes, we're going to read. So they were here for hours. These two went to their friend's house for hours. So I didn't have any other responsibilities. To, so I just sat here and I edited and I, I, I edited like all afternoon and oh, the battery's flashing but I'm gonna we're gonna end our video walking through this process with Ashley to go to bed because we're really struggling right Ashley and she admits it she's wearing this to bed because she's only had this on for like two or three hours and she wants to wear it to school tomorrow it's just easier if we wear it to bed right yeah and we're keeping these in even though we look really rough and tumbled for school tomorrow to have curly hair correct yeah. All right, got a new battery. This girl is really struggling to go to bed. So I thought we would make sure, even though we do night routine the same every night, nothing changes, she still struggles to go to bed. It don't make me in the room. She doesn't like going to bed. So tell them what you've done here. You wanna show them? I, I made a book. The problem with Melly. Right? Okay, now turn the page. Okay, so what did you tell them what you did? I found a, 
Um, I'm looking for my book, which to, um, a book to copy because I lost this notebook because I'm starting a book, but I just started a new one and I'm an, I just started doing this one. Not you wanted to one. practice your word writing, right? But this is what we're going to read for reading. And then what happens, Ashley, after that? One minute. No. What happens after we do our reading? Watch. How much? 15. We're going to read this. 15 minutes of screen time. And then we're going to bed. Do you agree? Yes? Yeah. No, you have to say it like you said it last night. Yeah. Say it like you mean it. Say it out loud. Yes. Yeah. No. What are you doing? <laughs> Going to bed. After 15 minutes of screen time and reading. Say it. After 15 minutes. 15 minutes. 15 minutes of screen time and reading. I promise, Mom. <laughs> because I love you so much. Because I love you so much. Hurry, the battery's flashing. Because I love you so much. I don't want to do it. Promise? Yeah. Okay, no screen time tomorrow night if you can't stay in bed. Okay. You have to promise all the ladies. Yeah. Okay. All right, so Ashley and I cleaned up her room. She's got her toys cleaned up. Her bed is ready. You've had your 15 minutes of screen time, and this is where we run into a problem, right? Yes. Climb into bed. Climb in, climb in. Where's your melatonin? Give it in your hand. Water? Do you need more water? Okay. Mm -mm. I need to see those two pills go in your mouth. I saw two hiding in a cup yesterday. <laughs> in your mouth. One. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Where is it? <laughs> Did you already put it back? Are you see she hit it? A little stinker. Take it. Take it. You just kind of struggle going to sleep, so we just need some extra help. Um, Swallow. I'll clean up. Swallow it. Hurry. And yes, I know her hair is kind of in shambles, but we're keeping the braids in. Okay, get in. Are you getting in the mermaid or no? Yeah. Climb up on your pillow. I'm turning out the light. I'm going to turn on your, no, can't tickle tonight, can't do my hair, because I'm not doing it tonight. You never. I do it every single night. Don't tell me no. I don't do it. Lay down. Do you want echo on? No. Okay, we'll do echo. Echo, turn on Pandora music. Frozen game intro radio from Pandora. Chelsea, thank you for, how about you um, lay down? Get your blanket. I don't want it right now. I'm pretty Okay. Okay. You're going to go to sleep. Okay, you guys. 7.35. She's already asked to come downstairs twice. Sometimes lately I don't, I purposely don't come downstairs. I wait upstairs in my room for her to get done with her screen time because I almost, she almost always will request to come downstairs. And I still haven't eaten dinner. I have all these potatoes here. I did not get them done in time for Kaylee and Abby to eat before they went to babysit. They're babysitting for two families. They're both cousins. Moms are both cousins. And they have five kids between them. And they all want to go out to dinner for one of their husband's birthdays. So it takes both Kaylee and Abby to babysit in order to like accommodate all these kids. And so they'll be home in like probably two hours um, and they'll probably eat again then but I'm gonna sit down and eat I've got smashed potatoes and some ham but I'm ha and an orange but I'm hesitant to sit down and eat because I don't think she's gonna stay in bed but it's bachelor night so I would really like to have everyone in bed asleep at least these two by 8 30 so that I can watch the pre-recorded first part of the show and then as I watch more and more, it gets recorded. So, I'm gonna enjoy my dinner here. And 
sit down to relax finally. Jason just got home. Say hi. I've got a plate of his food and then I've just done my food up there and he's getting my water for me. Thank you. I'll do, get some ice in there. And as soon as you eat, last step for Ashley is tickling her back. Mm -hmm. She's taking two melatonin. I just, she's got yeah, to like, so I know, she just needs to like have this mastered by now. Right? I know. It's annoying. So we're going to end the night. You can hear Jason brushing his teeth in the other room, but I just want to hurry and go to bed. So I'm not going to wait for him. But I, it only took one time of Ashley coming out of her room tonight. And even then it was a small whine and can I brush your hair? Can I tickle your back? And I said no. And I ignored her like I do most nights. And she kind of complained for a second. Jason caught her as he was coming down the stairs after his shower and he put her right back in bed, tickled her back for five minutes and we didn't hear from her again. So I just need to make sure that I include as part of her nighttime routine, tickling my back or brushing my hair, which I have a hard time saying no to. So I know part of the problem is my own, like <laughs> desire to have my hair brushed, but also just including that in, as a part of her routine. So starting the routine earlier, so she has time to do that and feels like she's gotten that extra time at night, but we're ahead of schedule on her going to bed so that she thinks it's her getting to stay up, but really it's going to bed on time. So I'm gonna work on that and hopefully she'll get better with that because I know she's tired in the mornings and she's extra cranky these days. She needs a solid 12 hours of sleep. She's still only six years old and so I just have to like remember that and you know, she'll be seven in just a couple months, but you know, gotta give her a chance to figure this all out. So also I'm going to note to future Dana as you're editing this, I want you to go back and put a clip of what my skin looked like just a week ago. There's a lot of shine to it right now. So I have an oil base on it right now, plus a lotion after I showered and I, my skin is really, really dry, and I got that oil and that face peel from my friend a week ago. I just returned her, her bottle of it today. Um, so I've used it for exactly one week, and I've used the peel twice, and I've used oil and lotion on my face twice a day, every day for seven days. And it's already clearing up, like my skin, like I don't have as many, <laughs> Jason's being, are you mocking me? No, it looks good. Um, that was a creepy finger showing up in the screen. <laughs> anyway, um, it's, I still have like, I don't know if it's rosacea. My, my skin is always red. Like it's been like a good 10 minutes since I put the lotion on and I still, it still looks red. But all of my little, you know, marks. Oh my gosh, you're so creepy. <laughs> Stop. They're all like, there's, they're not raised. Like there's the red, you know, there's red marks here. But it's not like raw skin and it's not dry skin. There's no flakies to it. Um, so the skin is healing. There's a little bit right here that I can, I can feel and pick at. But I'm going to try not to. Um, so the oil has really helped to hydrate my skin. And I'm just going to keep, maybe I'll keep progress with you guys just so I can see the results and see if my skin can get better. Um, I don't, I'm just now taking care of it a little bit better than I have in the past. And that's a sign that I'm over 40. So all you ladies in your 20s or 30s, there's not very many of you that watch this channel. Take care of your skin because <laughs> it doesn't last very long. Anyway, I'm tired. Where'd Jason go? Oh, he's down there doing push-ups. Give us a grunt, Jace. <laughs> he's literally like right oh. down. Oh, there's the grunt. Shush. Where are you? Where are you? Creepy. There you are. <laughs> anyway, take care, you guys. I hope you enjoyed our little get Ashley back on her nighttime routine. What we got to do. So 
Thank take you. care and we'll see you next time guys make sure you subscribe and click that bell right jace what oh my gosh you're not even listening oh, click the bell click the bell okay take care night